Hey there, McOwner here, and I'm back with some more Hearthstone. So, the last episode we unlocked everything, I believe, but then I think we also tried out the last two classes. Um, I played, or actually I don't know if I played Warlock yet, but I think we played Hunter and Paladin. I think Warlock is the only one I haven't played yet, but I mean I could be wrong, I can't remember. It's been a little bit since I jumped back in, but... I think we might actually try a match against a real person because our first quest is to play a complete a game, a uh, complete a game in play mode. So we don't even actually have to win, but we have to play, you know, I we have to play a, a real person. And from what I see here, we haven't played Warlock yet, and we haven't played a Druid yet. So I think I don't know if we're gonna actually play them. We might try. I think I still want to play a Rogue. I still want to get good at a rogue, but we will go to a play and see if if there's anything, like how do I, I guess we just use a basic deck? I don't think I can construct any yet. If I just click a rogue and hit play, I think it's just gonna pair us off with a random other person with a basic deck, I think. So we will try and see how well we do against a real person. Let's see. Anytime now. I mean, I know it's, it's, it's not that late. I mean, you'd think we'd find some people. Let's see. Oh, it's kind of with frame rates, and we are, yep, we're the opponent. Let's see how well we do. Blocks. I don't know who this is. Anyways. Oh, boy. That's not a very good hand. Uh, well, that's a little better, but I think we can get rid of these. Do you want, yeah, I guess we can keep the iron. It's actually not a great one, but at least it's a lower end card. So, oh, a lower costing card. Uh, okay, that's not bad. That's not bad. I have some late removal, which would be good. So I can guess coin novice engineer. It's not a very good one. You know, it could still get killed by a one coster. I think I might just end my turn. And I could do a. I for Rifleman isn't that great either. Let's just end turn, though. I don't really want to waste my coin on something like this that can still get killed by a one cost. I mean, it's good. It's okay. Okay, she's gonna fire blast me. Alright. That means she doesn't have anything that great either. Okay, Sinister Strike. Well. Hmm. Well, I guess we just play the Novice Engineer. Not much else we can do right now. I hope you like my invention. Probably be good. Get some card draw. Okay, deadly poison. Get some good removal for the weapon. Let's see. Cause yeah, I can use my dagger and then deadly poison, but hmm. Arcane intellect. Alright. So neither of us have gotten some great draws in the beginning anyway. I kind of want to save that, but I might just want to start getting- I could coin into Dragonling Mechanic. That might be a good thing, just to get some good board control. Only has 3 mana. I don't think- I forget how much it costs for a Flame Strike. They're pretty expensive, mm. I think, though. So I think that'll be the best play right now. Coin into Dragonling Mechanic. I don't think there's anything else that would be worthwhile. So we will coin. Dragonling Mechanic. Get some good board control. And smack you with the engineer and end turn. So let's see what you're gonna do now. You can kill my whelpling, but then you would only have two mana to play with. Are you gonna play something? Hmm, alright. Squash this. Yeah, okay. I forgot. I never really play around with this. Ah, uh, gong. Oh, mirror image to. Hmm, alright. I can I can still get rid of those with my things. Oh. Alright, what are you gonna do? One damage? Oh. E nope, please. Oh, you jerk. You lucked out with that. Hey, but I can... Ah, uh, well, I can't play it just yet. So, we'll hold on to that. I'm not gonna sap that. That'd be a waste. So... Rifleman's not really useful because both of these can kill it. I mean, it might be worth it just to get another creature on the field. Or maybe if I just play Elven Archer and a Rifleman just to get some more on the field. Maybe. That might be the best way just to get a good amount of board control. But it's getting closer to a 
being able to get flame striked. I think it might be worth it. Let's see, just to get this. It, I think I can. No, I can do this. I can play both of these, and I can get rid of one of them. And then I can use the dragonling to get rid of the last one and still hit them for two. Okay, that's not bad. I, I think I think it's okay play. I don't know if it was the best play, but I think it was still okay. So I still have really good board control. So I'm sorry. I don't remember how much a flame strike costs. I think it's between five and seven. So you can do that if right now, but it would use up all their mana. Okay, I'm just gonna fire blast my Welpley. Okay. And you have three mana, what are you going to do with it? What are you going to do? What, 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 what would you, what, what, what would you do? Okay, I don't know if anybody remembers that. It's dating me, but whatever. <laughs> ah, let's see. Come on. Alright, let's grow some, oh, oh, I guess that's it. Wow, you left three mana? No, oh, that's... Uh, I guess. If you don't have anything to play, you don't have anything to play. I mean, might as well... I might just throw in that Sinister Strike, because it's just 3 damage to enemy hero, if I can't play anything. I don't want to use Storm Ty Pike Commando. I kind of want to wait on that a little bit. I think I can just play Bloodfin Raptor. Hmm, I can use... I can Dagger Mastery and Deadly Poison. But maybe I should wait until there's actually something on the board. Is there anything? Well, I can... Yeah, I can use this. Do three damage. Might as well. And then I just... I'll just use the Dagger Mastery now. And just save it. So then let's tack it at everything. Alright, and end turn. Okay, I think we're doing okay. But... Uh, if I get hit by a Flame Strike, it's gonna suck hard. Because that's pretty much... I think everything is dead. And I don't really have any other creatures besides my Storm Pike, Storm Pike Commando. But we will see what happens. What to do? Mm, what you're to thinking do? about that? Freeze them. Okay. All right. Hold back to hold back the tide of damage for right now. It's not bad. You're gonna you're gonna fire blast one. You're gonna fire fire blast my Elven Archer. I mean, if you don't have anything else to play, I would do that. Still thinking though. Squish all these. And grow some more. I don't know. Gong. What's this? Can he hit this? Just clicking around. Oh, what are you doing? No, not my raptor. I guess, you know, get rid of the highest damage potential. Might as well. Ooh, okay, that's a good thing that I did not use my deadly poison yet. Okay, that was a good thing and I hold off that I held off on that. Okay. So I can get a taunt out. But I can get the Storm Commando and get rid of the Ooze. I might... I think that's probably the best play. I, there's no way I'm, I'm not going to send that back to the hand. This is destroy my daggers again. I mean, that'd be insane. Anyways. But I can get this. Get rid of that. And we put down the... Probably, like, the one of the worst taunts. It's not a very good taunt. Get, still get killed by one cost. It is a one cost itself, but... Well, I guess that's it for right now. 7-7, seven, seven. do you have a Flame Strike? I don't know if the basic decks start out with Flame Strike. I don't think so. I don't remember getting one when I was playing. I don't know how much this person's leveled. If it's supposed to be evenly matched, I don't think they would have one. So I could be okay. What you want. Okay, you get your own taunt. So let's see. How do we want to deal with this? We will probably just trade... The Rifleman? You're gonna Fire Blast something. I know you will. Unless, you, unless you're actually gonna use something in your hand. You're taking your sweet time with that, though. Hmm. Okay, yep. That's to be expected. Uh, save this Assassinate for one of the... They're probably gonna have a big card. I'm gonna save that. So let's see. I can also Deadly Poison. I got another Assassinate. Hmm. I want to save the Sap for something, too. So what we can do... Is we can dagger. So we have two, and then we deadly poison. So yeah, it's a three, two, and we will smack you, get rid of you, and we will attack you with everything we got. Alright, so we are 
pretty much in the lead. He's got a big card advantage on me, but he is very much trailing in health and has no board control. So I think we're in a good spot. I don't like that I left so much mana there, but there's nothing really I could have done. I hate having that much leftover mana. But, you know, happens. Hmm, so let's see... I have no creatures, so basically I will assassinate something if it's- if he puts out any big creatures, I can just assassinate it. I might sap it, then I would play it again and then assassinate it. That'd just be horrible. Ooh, getting rid of- uh, I guess, you know, that's one of my highest damage outputs. Trying to save him, but I think, because I have three there, I think- is he still dead? No, it's not dead. Oh, another fireball? Jesus. That kind of sucks. Waste two fireballs? I think I'll hold on to this then. We will summon a Dragonling Mechanic. And we'll hold on to this just in case they put out, any put out anything. And then... We will... Attack. And end turn. So we will hold on to that three. Because then if he can't get rid of a good amount of my stuff, I think I can still kill him, unless he gets a taunt out. He's got a lot of mana to use though. He can get rid of the- he can get rid of the whelpling. So that's two damage less, and he's gonna do that. So I have five damage potential on the field right now. Ooh, an arc mage. Alright, so I think we win. Yeah, we win. Uh, just because I can. Let's see. Five. Okay, yeah, just because I can, I'm going to assassinate this. And we'll play Stormwind Knight. Uh, take this. And I will stab you and finish. I have no idea how to use the macro thing or, or the or the talking or whatever. But oh, oh we didn't do didn't do too bad against our first real player. First blood. Expert oh, I got a pack. Cool. And fan of knives. Ooh, that's kind of nice to kill a lot of the weaklings. So let's see. Let's. Oh, a new quest. The duelist. Play three games in play mode. Okay. Let's see. Let's go. We'll play one more quick match. Do we want to play the rogue again? Yeah, we'll stick with the rogue. We'll play one more quick one, hopefully. Hopefully it will go as well as the last one. Can't say for sure. Do, 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 do. And then after this match, we will open up the pack that we got and see what we get. And another worthy opponent. Opponent, I think it always says that. From what I've seen of other videos. Okay, we're going against a druid. So, let's see. Ooh, that's not a bad... It's not a bad hand. I wish I got a one-coster, but... Hmm... I think we'll just hold on to that. Actually, yeah, we'll hold on to this. We'll, we'll be fine. So, nothing on the first turn though. It kind of sucks. We'll just end turn. So let's see. What are you gonna play? Oh, ow! A moonfire. I mean, I guess there's not much else you can do with it. I would have saved that for like a uh, one health minion. But, you know, so, hmm, I can get a card, or I can get that out in the field. You have a two-coster, I think. Yeah, it still can get killed by a one-coster, which is not great. So maybe if I go with the draw card, maybe that might be the best thing. <sighs> yeah, maybe. Eeny, I can't decide, really. Because Bloodfin Raptor is not that good. It's okay, but it's not the greatest turn 2 play. We'll go draw a card, just try to get through our deck and see if we can get something good. Okay, Sap, that's not bad. Get something... If he puts something dangerous on the field, I can put it back to his hand. And I can always backstab something if he puts it out, you know. Oh, I guess I should end my turn. Yeah, that'd be good. <laughs> Sorry. But yeah, I don't know if that was... The better play to play that one or to play the Bunflin Raptor. Okay, let's see. He, it might be better because he might use up stuff to get rid of the engineer. 
and then I can play the raptor the next turn. Ooh, okay, that's not good. I should have played the raptor, and then I could have gotten rid of it. But we can trade that out before that wind fury gets out of control. We can backstab and then throw the engineer at it, and then we can put down the blood from raptor. I think that'd be okay. I don't really want to sap that. I want to save it for a higher cost. So we will backstab because that doesn't cost anything. Throw that, get rid of it, and we will play. Yeah, we'll play Blood from Raptor this time. And turn. Because I should have. I, I mean, yeah, so. Yeah, I used my backstab for that. Maybe that wasn't. Maybe if I could have just a straight up trade, I could have saved my backstab, but. Hmm. Alright. I guess that's fine. Uh, let's see, what do we want to do here? I can play Dragonling Mechanic, or I can do a Novice Engineer and Dagger. Hmm. But then he's going to trade that out anyway. I have two saps, maybe I want to do that so I can just keep board control. I can always just play the Dragonling Mechanic though. Hmm. Just go straight for him with that, and the Bloodstorm Raptor will probably die. That might be the better play, I think. Just me and Mr. That. And I just go straight after him. If he wants to trade out, get rid of my raptor, he can do that. If he doesn't, next turn I can get rid of it with the whelpling. If he just wants to go straight for me. Again, like I'm still learning, so I don't know if these are the best plays or not. But I'm I'm going with my logic here. Oh, well, he's got another one. Okay, and then, oh, he's gonna get rid of the raptor. Okay, you can do that. That's fine. And, okay, assassinate's good. But we can get this. Yeah, we'll put out the Stormfight Commando. We don't even have to lose. Or, we don't have to take any damage in the future, but we can do that. I don't even know what I said there. Like, the audio is kind of blocking my speech. And I was not think I. Okay, whatever. Maybe I have this too loud. <laughs> but we were able to not have to trade out anything for that last minion, so that's good. Oh, I should end my turn. Yeah, that'd be helpful. I need to remember to do that. Let's see, what do you got? For the crusade! Ah, dang it. Oh, what are you doing now? Oh, you have and you give it taunt, really? Dang. Okay, what am I gonna do with this? Because anything I play against it dies. Will that even work? Will assassinate just destroy it? I can send it back to his hand. Oh, I think I should send it back to his hand. Yes. I'm sorry. You put all that stuff on it. It's gonna go back to your hand. I'm sorry. No, I'm not. Um. Uh, let's see. I, might as well put down the Nomich Inventor. It's a better novice engineer. So I get a card. Oh, it's Taunt. And now we attack what we have. And end turn. Why is that? That's a little glitch there. Graphical thing. Are you going to play your Scarlet Crusader again? Probably. That's the one. Yeah. Yeah, you're playing it again. Okay, yeah. That was a graphical glitch. But now it doesn't have Taunt anymore. Which is good. So now I can get rid of that Wind Fury. We need to get rid of that. That is not a good thing to have out in the field. So, what do we want to do? We want to be a do we want to be a dick and send back the Scarlet Crusader again? Maybe, possibly. I think we do. I think we do, because I think that's like a three cost or something. Or maybe we should save it. I could. Hmm. Because if I hit that, I could get rid of that, and then this... Okay, I can, I can actually get rid of anything and only lose my commando, so... Maybe? Hey, so I can save my cards? I don't want to use up too many of my cards yet. I don't want to burn out my, what I have. Because then, um, I can put down a novice engineer. Put down a nightblade, too. Maybe I should put down the nightblade. Might as well. Get that out there. Three damage. And end turn. Look, I got all this stuff. I have lots of board control. We're even on cards. And he has a lot less health than me. So I think I'm doing okay. Let's see. 
but I my creatures are pretty weak right now. Two, one health. But we'll see. Oh, what? just a second. Where shall I strike? All right, let's hopefully this match will quick be quick. I have to get laundry. It's finished. But let's see. I have to turn off the timer real quick. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, anyways, let's see. Let's see if we can end this. That is a, a lot of things. Maybe we should assassinate it. We can sap it. If we sap it, then he can play it again, and then I can assassinate it. That will use up more of his mana. Let's do that. We will sap it. Will rise against you. Not that. Not that turn, though. So we will play another strangling mechanic. We should use a dagger instead of a just footman. Now we'll get the footman out. Just have like a little taunt that he has to deal with. And hit him with everything. We have very, very good board control right now. He's dead next turn if he can't get rid of, like, a lot of things. Oh, he gave up. Oh! I wanted it to end quick after that, and it did. But yeah, we didn't do too bad. So let's see, do we unlock anything else with the rogue? The next word level shiv. Okay. Alright. So one more win, and we get 10 gold. And... One out of three, level up, get any class to level 10. Okay, those are our new quests, so... Well, this is not new, we got one out of three. But now we have another quest to get... We'll probably get the rogue up to level 10 first, just so we can get that. So, I think, yep, yeah, we're gonna end it here. Because I got some stuff I have to take care of, like yeah. I was saying. But, that was fun. And, you know, I'm not doing too bad. Two out of two, with the rogue, against people. Yeah, it's unranked mode, of course, but... You know, I'm still practicing. But anyways, if you like the video, please hit the like button. You can comment, uh, hit favorite. It helps me out. If you want to keep up with everything, you can subscribe to me on YouTube. You can follow me on Twitter. Or you can do both. It'd be good. But until next time, take care, guys. Oops, I'm back. One thing I forgot. Yeah, I'm editing back this back in. But we did get a pack, so I'm gonna quickly open that, and we'll see what we get. I'm sorry, I forgot about that. I got a pack on the first thing. So let's see, what did we get? Alright, so... Alright. Earth and Ring Farseer. Mad Bomber. Ooh, okay. I've seen that. It could be good or bad, the RNG on that. Battle Rage. Okay, a warrior card. Alright. Oh, a rare. Master Spell. Okay, that's good for the priest. Nice. Silence all enemies and Earth Shock for the Shaman. Alright. So, we got these cards. They're, uh, they're okay, I think. Uh, I mean, I barely have any cards, so it might be good. I mean, they're all good, because I'm not going to get rid of any of them, you know. So I have all these cards. But, anyways, I <laughs> think now, sorry, I forgot to do that before I ended the recording, but then I'm putting this in at the end. But now... Until next time, take care guys.